It was right here, and now it's gone. How terrible, Baroness. I know how much you liked that one. It was one of my favorites as well. Yes, it is terrible. But I want it back at any cost, and that's why I had the two of you come here. I beg you, please find it and bring it back to me. Pardon my question, but what exactly was it that got stolen from you, Baroness Apfelkuchen? Uh, Apfelkuchen. It is my hummel, my favorite hummel. It has an immeasurable personal worth, and it is also worth quite a bit of money. And if I may, what exactly is a hummel? It's a porcelain figurine. They often buy cute children cute. doing all kinds of pastimes. They are adorable. And adorable. Beautiful craftsmanship. And sometimes quite valuable. It's valuable. As collector items. I want it back at any cost. And I'm more than willing to pay whoever brings it back to me very handsomely. I see, I see, very well. Let's not lose time then. Is there anyone who I can question? No need. The neighbor, Colonel Richard, already called me this morning. And he is a very light sleeper and suffers from regular insomnia. He saw a man leave my house. Saw him as clear as daylight, he claims. Good old Colonel, such a dear. Luckily, he's kept his reflexes and immediately drew up a composite image of what he thought the culprit looked like. Not to worry, Baroness. I will return your possessions to you. Yes, Tobias, of course you will. I'm sure there is nowhere he can hide from I'm you. Sure there's no one but hide. more seriously, Baroness, do not worry. I will actually find your, your home. Oh, thank you. Whoever brings it first will get the full reward. Very well, let's not lose time then. Baroness? Baroness, I was wondering if I may have that tea from last time. Maybe some of that excellent Earl Grey we had last time. Oh, certainly. I shall have the maid bring us some. It's not easy being on the side of the law in a city that has none. Every day is a struggle. I, Tobias Smith, have been called to duty by a client. She was robbed of her most prized possession. She called on to me for help, and I shall assist her with all my talent as a detective. Excuse me, could you tell me where is the um, photo with you? Mm. What? Yes. Photo with you? Oh, ah, uh, photo with you, yes. Uh, you go down this street, then you go to the left, or no, 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 no. You go down that street, and then you go to the right. No, ah. Uh, Okay, you go down this way, then you go to the left, then you go to the right, then you go straight. There it is, that's Ponte Vecchio. Okay. This city needs someone to rise and fight crime. I have risen to the task, but every day is a struggle. What has happened to humanity? I'm tired, tired of running after crime. I seem to never be able to relax, seem to always be on the edge. Why are we doing this to each other? Today, no one is reaching out a helping hand, and if they do, beware. And ask yourself, 
Why? Ah, yes. Coffee. It's the only thing that keeps me sharp. Ready to face the danger. For danger lurks everywhere and it is all around us. This lowlife has robbed an old woman. She's a loyal client, but most of all, she's a friend. Since that thing with the search for snuffles, she values my presence. I make her feel safe, and I hope that one day this city as well will feel safe under my watchful eye. Do you want this time to buy us? I don't... <clears throat> I don't know. Something strong like... Uh, whiskey. Whiskey. At 9.30 in the morning. Okay. Uh, something else like... This man. Why are you looking for him? He stole a humble from a friend. A what? A humble? And what in the hell is a hummel? A hummel? <clears throat> a small porcelain figurine. The priceless. They come in all different shapes, colors, sizes. A little boy. A little fishing girl. A dog. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. I don't care. Let's say I know who this man is. Let's even say I know where to find him. What's in it for me? Just doing the right thing should be enough. 
but I am willing to pay for my information. How about you buy a RAM for these folks here as well? All right. First the money, then the information, then the RAM. <clears throat> Good man. The man you're looking for is Mario Rossi. Rossi. He usually eats his lunch at Sabatini's. Sabatini's. I know the place. Your best shot at finding him is go look for him there. Well, around for everybody. Hello. Have you <clears throat> seen? Sorry. Sorry. Have you seen this man? Carolina Wilkinson Perriera. Pereira. Well, in any case, what are you doing here? I'm enjoying an operative while waiting for you. <laughs> but why are you here? Well, it looks like I got here before you, don't you think? But how? What do you mean, how? I was quicker, and probably also considerably more effective than you. Hmm. <sighs> and, uh, where is Mario Rossi? Forget him. It doesn't matter where he is. What matters? that I have this. The Hummel? Yes, the Hummel. I got it before you. But do you know what? I want to offer you a deal. This was too easy for me. And I know that you would like to be the one who brings this thing back to Baroness Apfelkuchen. So I say, we play for it. The winner gets to keep the Hummel, collect the reward, and get showered in glory. <laughs> you want to play for it? What game? Chess? Crime isn't a game to me. Also, I don't know how to play chess. How about... Uno. Yes, sure. Let's play a round of Uno for it.
is a feast. Rolling in the Rolls Royce Caniche. Only the doctors got this, I'm hiding from police. Cocaine seats, all white like I got the whole thing bleached. Drug dealer chic. I'm wondering if a dog's prayers reach. It's pious, pious, for God loves pious. Socrates acts who's pious. Uno. I win. Indeed you did. And now hand over the Hummel. Fair is fair. Here you go. Now go and bring your prize to the Baron. 